What's happening everyone, my name is Alex and welcome back to a new speed test. For today I have the Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus and the LG V30. So both devices have very very similar specs. So we have the Snapdragon 835, we have 4 gigs of RAM and 64 gigs of internal storage. Now the internal storage seems to be a bit faster on the LG V30 and that may have to do with the fact that we get a higher score on the Antutu benchmark on the V30 compared to the S8 Plus. So for our first test we are going to check out and see which device unlocks faster with the fingerprint scanner and both devices have the fingerprint scanners right on the back. So I'm going to go ahead and lock both of them and I will try touching the fingerprint scanners in the exact same time. And let me slow that down for you. And it seems that the S8 Plus was slightly faster. And we are going to try the same test one more time just to make sure that um, we did it right the first time. So I'm going to lock the screens on both of them and we'll try touching the fingerprint scanners in the same time. So let me slow that down for you but it seems that the S8 Plus um, was slightly faster but let's slow it down. So yes the S8 Plus was faster at unlocking the screen. Alright, so for our next test, I'm going to start opening the exact same apps in the same time. Both devices are connected to the 4G network, so no Wi-Fi for either of them. And I'm also going to show you that I don't have any apps running in the background. Both devices are running Nova Launcher, so that's why they look um, a bit different. So we're going to start opening Chrome in the same time on both of them. So very, very close. I can't really say which one was um, faster. We're just going to open uh, the same article on both. So it was definitely a bit faster on the S8 Plus and we'll just um, close those ads and we'll leave that one running in the background. The next one is going to be the Google Now app. So once again very very similar at um, opening the app. The next one is going to be the Facebook app. So once again maybe the S8 Plus was a bit faster maybe but um, very very close um, so no difference um, whatsoever. The next app is going to be the Twitter app on both. So maybe the V30 was um, faster for um, that one. So uh, we'll leave that one running in the background. The next uh, one is going to be GTA San Andreas on both. So it was a bit faster on the V30, but let's see which device actually loads the game sooner. So let's press resume on both. So maybe a bit faster on the V30. Yeah, definitely a bit faster on the V30 on that one. But um, eventually the games kind of open in the same time. So maybe the V30 was a, a bit faster. Let's open the YouTube app on both. So once again I believe that the V30 was faster, we'll just open up the first one here. And I believe it was a bit faster on the S8 Plus to start that. We'll next open uh, Temple Run 2. And kind of in the same time. We'll just give it a second to see which one loads faster. And maybe the S8 Plus um, did that one faster I believe. Yeah, so definitely the S8 Plus um, was faster for that one. We'll leave that running in the background. The next one is going to be Google Photos on both. So uh, very, very similar for that one. The next one is going to be Instagram on both. And I believe the V30 is a bit faster um, on that one. And we'll just open my account here. And let's just open a random picture. So maybe the S8 Plus was a bit faster uh, for that one. So we'll leave that one running in the background. And the last one is going to be a speed test. So once again, very similar. Let's see if they're on, on the same server. So let's press change server and let's select the same server on both. And let's press begin test. And um, I'll fast forward. So once again kind of similar speeds however the S8 Plus was uh, just a bit faster. So now I'm curious to see what happened with all those apps that we have running in the background. So let's uh, go from the beginning. So Chrome. So let's open Chrome on both. And the S8 Plus actually had to reload uh, that first uh, page. So we'll leave that one running in the background. We'll go to the next one and the next one it's Google Now. 
and once again the SA Plus had to reload uh, that so we'll leave that one running in the background the next one is gonna be the Facebook app so they're kind of in the same time um, for uh, that one in the same place the next one is gonna be the Twitter app and once again the SA Plus kind of had to reload but it didn't actually reload so I'm not sure so let's move to GTA San Andreas on both so unfortunately the SA Plus had to reload that game um, once again that's um, quite unfortunate we'll leave that one running in the background and let's go to the YouTube app on both oh wow so the SA Plus had to reload um, that one as well Last time I've done this uh, test to the S8 Plus wasn't as bad. So uh, let's see. Oh wow. Temple Run 2 had to be <laughs> reloaded once again. That's um, quite unexpected to, to be honest. So we'll leave that one running in the background. And let's see what else we have there. We have Google Photos. And uh, well uh, the S8 Plus had to reload that one uh, as well. And let's see what happened to Instagram. I guess that one is uh, still running in the background. So there you have it guys. Um, I guess the V30 was a bit faster for certain apps. But for the fingerprint scanner unlock the S8 Plus um, was a bit faster. But the V30 was definitely better for um, RAM management. Alright guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did like it, press that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.